College football now, and after a promising 3-0 start, the Finley Oilers have dropped two in a row heading into today's matchup with Walsh. One in four Cavaliers might be just what the doctor ordered for the Oilers as Rob Key's offense looks to get back on track this afternoon. Check out these dance moves from Derek the Oiler. And he's dancing because Finley leads 20 to nothing in the second quarter. Oilers with the football. Verlon Reed play action, sets up the screen to Chauncey Bridges, and he's got some blockers in front of him down the near sideline. Finally brought down at the 10. It sets up a field goal. Finley now leads 23 to nothing. Defense on the field. Paul Kemp wants to pass. He's leveled by Miles Alexander. That's a sack, and the Cavaliers are forced to punt. So Reed back on the field looking to pass. Huge game for the Finley quarterback. Gets a little help here, though. Obvious contact with his intended target, Lloyd Henry. Pass interference is called. After the penalty, Reed wants to throw again. Looking deep for Henry again. This time they connect. One of Henry's school record 15 catches on the day. A lot of records fell today. We'll get to those in a minute. Later in the drive, Reed to Henry again. This time it's a touchdown. Oilers lead 30 to nothing. Henry finished with a school record 202 receiving yards. Second half now more of the same for Finley. Deep ball again, right in stride to Darnell Fields. And he's tripped up from behind at the 15. That sets up another field goal try, but Look out, it's a fake. Tyler Bugia takes it and goes untouched into the end zone. Finley wins big 47 to seven. It was a historic offensive day. Oilers set school records with 456 passing yards and 35 first downs, while Reed set a school record with 414 yards to go along with his three touchdowns.